Now, where local sports always come first, this is Action for Sports. Only two Valley football teams were left standing in the third round of the playoffs to start tonight. And of those two, only one squad had been to the fourth round before. Action 4 Sports reporter Joe Bowling live in Kingsville for Havelina Stadium. But he's talking about the game in Corpus Christi with Port Isabel and Navarro. Joe. And coming to you from Havelina Stadium in Kingsville, I've made the jump from one of our stadiums to the other uh, featuring our Valley teams. But let me get to this Port Isabel game. If you wanted to write a script for a game and throw in everything you could to make fans want to watch it, this was it. Teams coming from behind, teams coming out in overtime and winning the game. This is what happened here tonight as the Port Isabel Tarpons laid it on the line. Let's get to the highlights. In the first half, Javier Vela and the Tarpons were down by two scores, but Vela breaks off a 55-yard run, is in the end zone, and the comeback is on. A little bit later, Isaiah Martinez, the quarterback, would rumble into the end zone, and the Tarpons took a 14-13 lead. Back and forth we'd go, my friends. It was by far not even close to over. The Navarro Panthers would not go away. They get into the end zone, then go for a two-point conversion, and a big hit kind of set the tone that the Tarpons were here to play. They went into the fourth quarter, and went on a 96-yard drive, my friends, with the less than two minutes to go. And then with six seconds to go, Vela took it in the end zone. Two-point conversion on a pass play from Martinez to Vela, and it was a tie game. We went into overtime, and the Tarpons scored another touchdown. Big-time highlights coming in for that one tomorrow on Sunday Sports Extra. After this game, though, Tarpons win. Coaches and players were happy. Uh, you know, that drive of the fourth quarter there, it was huge. I mean, 95 yards, I think we threw one pass, and luckily we got it, you know. But, you know, the heart, I, I don't know how to describe. I mean, it's, it's, it's something you can't describe. Well, you know, it means a lot, you know. A lot of momentum is going to kick into the next round, you know. We knew we could beat them. You know, we just have to play with heart, and we did. And so for a second time in as many years, the Valley team has made it now to the fourth round of the playoffs as the Port Isabel Tarpons are victorious tonight, 35-28 in overtime. Coming to you live from Havelinia Stadium, I'm Joe Bowling for Action 4 Sports. All right, thanks a lot, Joe.